The European Commissioner for Trade is making it clear to China that the EU will protect its own economic interests during a trip to the Asian country. Over the past few weeks and months, the bloc has stepped up its rhetoric on what it calls Beijing's unfair trade practices. On Monday, in the Chinese capital, Valdis Dombrovskis criticized the imbalance with China. The lack of reciprocity and level playing field from China, coupled with wider geopolitical shifts, have forced Europe to become more assertive. Uh, we have developed autonomous tools to protect our interests where our openness it, uh, is at risk, and we have developed other tools to safeguard our own economic security and the level playing field in our internal market. Earlier this month, European Commission President Ursula von der Leyen announced a probe into subsidized Chinese electric cars entering the EU market. Following a meeting in Beijing with the bloc's trade chief, China's vice premier expressed his country's concern at this investigation. One of the EU's major concerns is its trade deficit with China, which has increased to nearly 400 billion euros. This, as well as tensions over Beijing's position on the war in Ukraine, are some of the main reasons for Brussels' tougher tone. According to one expert, the EU's also worried about its more long-term economic security, particularly in relation to the green transition. And there is a feeling that uh, with China doing very well in some areas like electric vehicle, with the United States, on the other hand, having rolled out the uh, IRA plan and subsidies, uh, we in the EU are getting squeezed uh, in an area which we feel it's very, very important, not just for the transition, but also for our future uh, economic uh, economic strategy. With tensions high between Brussels and Beijing, the EU's trade chief will be hoping that his trip helps to stop the two sides drifting apart. Chris Pitchers for Euronews.